everyone. Now, this video will teach you how to regenerate this transmitter for the Western Digital hard drives. Now, let's power on the drive. The WD drive has been connected to DFSRP firmware repair hardware. And I have power on the drive. Now, the drive gets ready. Enter the program in normal mode. And then enter the program and auto get detail click ok to enter the program here check modules and we can see the full module list click module id and then all the modules will be reordered now we can see that this is ordered module list so these are menus too and users can click it to order all the modules and also here hex now let's see once we have entered this program the very first thing is to back up the ROM Back up the ROM and ROM modules too. Back up the ROM modules here and also back up all the from the modules. Only if you have a backup of all the firmware modules and ROM modules and ROM, then users can uh, rest assured to use the firmware repair functions within this program. Here we can see in the defects translator, we can, before we clear translator, we can open the translator here see there are hex data yeah hex data is inside and 32 this is also the translator 2 it's a genus translator and uh, 31 is a pilot translator so before we regenerate the translator uh, we need to clear the translator and in the knock window we can see that uh, 31 and 32 translator clearing success. So after these knocks appear in the lock window and we can go to the defects menu, translator and translator regeneration. And we can check in the lock window and wait until the translator regeneration completes. We can also go to the servo monitoring and we can see now the program is regenerating the translator now. That means to regenerate the module 31 and module 32. So we just need to wait until now we can see that execution success. Now we go to the module list and try to check the hex data is back. That means we have done the transcendent regeneration. So we after we regenerate the transcendent, we can go to the execute from restart. Now the drive gets ready again, then we can re-enter the program. We can try to scan. So the drive is now in perfect condition. This means we have done the transfer regeneration completely. Thank you for watching.